what are things that you can do to these properties that are going to prevent them from costing you money? How can we reduce hassle? How can we reduce cost on these properties? What can we do to make these more profitable, bulletproof rental investments? The fifth thing that I want you to do to bulletproof your rental property is remove any and everything that can be clogged, hung on, broken, or injure a tenant. If you were to look around your home right now, I bet you there are a ton of things around your house that are just asking to be broken. When we're looking at these properties, we need to see them as investment vehicles. So we need to go through, fine tune these investment vehicles and reduce anything that can create a problem. Anything that can create additional costs without adding additional income. For example, window blinds. Window blinds, if you provide window blinds to your tenants, these are easily broken during the tenancy and they don't add any additional value. Nobody is going to pay more money to rent your house or apartment because you provided them with window blinds. That is a cost that you can simply push onto the tenant so you don't need to worry about fixing or replacing window blinds during the tenancy or in between the tenancies. Ceiling fans. Ceiling fans add zero additional value to your rental property. If it's too hot, the tenants have air conditioning for that. You don't want any ceiling fans because that's something that's moving. It's something that can be hung on by children or drunk adults. So go ahead and remove all ceiling fans. Light fixtures with pool chains. You don't need to have anything with a pool chain in these properties. Go through the property, remove anything that has a pool chain. A light switch is a much better alternative than anything with a pool chain. Chandeliers. I mean, come on. Chandeliers, get those out of here. That is just money being sucked out of your bank account if you're trying to have large chandeliers in your rental properties. Wall sconces. Anytime you have something hanging off of a wall, that is a potential problem. Remove all wall sconces. Towel racks and bars. You don't need those. Nobody is going to rent your property or not rent your property because you didn't provide them a place to hang their towel. That's just not something people think of. Towel racks are just something that is an easy path to destruction. Think about how easy it is for someone to grab that towel rack, rip it off the wall. Now you have your towel rack you need to replace and you need to get somebody in there to completely repair the drywall. You don't need to worry about it. Glass doors. You don't need glass doors. You have to provide a door. Why provide a door that is easily broken? Let's just provide the tenants with a normal door and eliminate the risk of a ball or a person going through that glass, costing you time and money. You're going to have to fix the door and you may have hospital bills for that tenant. That is not something you want to deal with. There is no upside to having doors with glass in them in your rental properties. Moving into the kitchen, dishwashers and garbage disposals. You may have a dishwasher and a garbage disposal at your personal residence, but you need to think, who is my tenant base? This is more important when you're renting to low income or tenants on the lower end of that pricing spectrum. These luxuries that you may be used to might not be the norms in that particular neighborhood. So if they aren't the norm in that neighborhood, I do not recommend you include them in your rental property because dishwashers and garbage disposals are very easily broken. These items can be money pits for a landlord. Lastly, gas stoves. Now, admittedly, this risk is incredibly, incredibly low, but we can never eliminate risk when we are rental property owners. We can simply mitigate it, and we want to mitigate it as much as humanly possible to help preserve our ROI. So instead of having gas stoves in my rental properties, I prefer to have electric stoves in my rental properties. A tenant's having a party or they're brushing up against the stove, they lean against it, gas is pumping into your rental property. Next thing you know, a spark, a lighter, a cigarette, you know, causes a fire or a small explosion. Admittedly, that's incredibly low risk, but the risk is still existent. So why deal with it? Simply eliminate it. Let's bulletproof these rental properties. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.